Hello everyone, hello everyone. It's freezing cold out here. I'm about to trade the NZD interest rates decision. I have $32. Account balance with hot forex markets. I'm about to trade the NZD USD interest rates decision at uh, 4 a.m. 24th of May on a Wednesday. It's freezing cold, guys. Yo. Okay, it's nearly there. Keep going in, guys. Bye, stop. Uh, I changed the market refused for me to put in a lot, a lot big, a lot size. So I'll go in with this. I can't bloom. Wow. I can't bloom, guys. That's what's up. Big spread, 170 drop. Bloom uh, the account. I took a loss, guys. The market went against me. <sighs> 4 a.m. And we out. This is about how much? How many points? 481. 481. Minus. Oh, and it's moving. really moving okay let's see guys uh, it's the NZD one minute later on our time frame I could have been out right now I actually wanted to to use the modific the beast mode strategy whereby actually the one minute strategy with the pending orders i wanted to use buy stop up there and sell stop somewhere here and then the market was, was going to determine whether it's buying or selling but i just changed my mind at the last minute thinking that since we failed to break this daily daily horizontal line then the price is still up maintaining above this horizontal line then I, I i believe that we are going to push to the upside possibly i anticipated the sell but i was i was I anticipated that we possibly push to the upside before we start to drop from the high because we sell high and we buy low and price currently here it was low that's what i was thinking unfortunately sellers overwhelmed the market and then it went against me And it's a huge, beautiful move. Let me calculate it. 
6283 minus the current movement is 161 okay let me go here to the low 61861 61861 that's about 622 points so so 622 points multiply by 0 0.18 lot size is equals to about 111 dollars i was possibly gonna make 111 dollars the past month i didn't trade this event because I, it missed me i think i uh i overslept or something as well as the news guys the news were positive for the for the nzt so uh, i used fundamental news and it's a beautiful move unfortunately i was not in So this is the loss that I took today. This is in this amount is in dollars. This amount is in dollars. Thirty three point twenty eight. Okay. Thirty three point. Let's look at Google on how much uh, this is. Thirty three point twenty eight. Thirty three point twenty eight dollars to the. Okay, so it's roughly about. Oh, not an hour. Oh, what's happening? Just thirty three point thirty eight. It's roughly six hundred and forty one. Six hundred and forty one rents. We just lost the lot. This is more than what I always lose. This is more than what I always lose. And the market is it's, it's still dropping, guys. 100 points later, this, the market is still dropping. Look at the one hour chart. The market is sweating. So let me show you the pair correlation. Remember I spoke about the pair correlation. So on the NZD, let me show you AUD, USD. So with this pair correlation, AUD, US, NZD went opposite. AUD, NZD went opposite direction. Look at it, it's positive even. You see, AUD NZD went the opposite direction to the NZD USD. I'm thinking of something. Thinking of something I will do on the next NZD event. Uh, I didn't come and analyze the AUD NZD first, and I'm seeing that this one was low usually when you get such a candlestick on a low then we could possibly have a pullback so i could have followed this one in order to trade the nzt i'll i'll have to back test the strategy first so guys this is not gambling this is pure trading based on research and analysis as well as experience and the truth is that it happens that you lose it happens that you lose a lot of money within just seconds as you've seen how i lost it's not the first time i'm losing and it won't be the first time i lose but then there will be more more wins that are coming such wins are coming so if you stay with me long enough and follow my work you'll get to see my wins as well so guys i hope you guys made some good profits i for myself let me see uh, this is about how much points let's calculate it from the high six two five two six two five two two minus the low of the session of the nz the interest rate decision six one seven o two it goes to 820 points so 820 points multiply by lot size zero point uh let's see oh oh i used even 0 0.16 Multiply by 0 0.16 is equals to $131. I could have made $131 just by 
just on on one single trade if i had the sell stop order set here i could have made more than 130 dollars so let's see how much 130 dollars is 130 us dollar that's roughly 2500 rents that's roughly 2500 rents that i was potentially going to make had i took modification strategy or the one minute strategy using pending orders as well as the best mode strategy just taking the market direction which was the sell you understand that's it for me guys i got smoked and then yeah uh, I have to go back to the drawing board. I got smoked on such a beautiful event. Could have made a lot. But then it's, it's, it is it is what it is, guys. It is what it is. As a trader, you have to be strong on such moments and be able to come back. So I'll, put, I'll, I'll have to make sure that I recover this much. Honestly, I've had a losing streak since been like, what? Maybe uh, two months, roughly two months I've been losing. Or I could say four weeks, yeah, not two months because I, I made money. That was not profit, it was recovery. I made money. Oh, uh, this actually, this month has been one of the worst months that I've ever had this year. Because there's no event that I, I won. I only won the NFP. I only won the NFP, guys. This was the May NFP. So what happened is that... Uh, the market ne? i took a buy signal i wanted to take a buy actually on this zone let's change the color okay i took a i wanted to take a buy here but where i was the network was bad so when i, I wanted to open the order here at the time of opening the order the first 0 0.07 lot then the trade couldn't go, couldn't go through the network was not uh good you understand it kept on loading and then i closed the the chart and then opened the app again then i i returned firstly i had actually this was the order the first order so firstly i had to put in the best stop order i set in the best stop order and then later five seconds before i had to put in the buy the sell the market execution that's when the app was starting to this 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 order alone took longer than 40 seconds for me to open this one when i wanted to open this one then the network was going crazy the order didn't go through so i ended up not making about 300 trends you understand Where, whereas i could have made potentially uh roughly 2500 you understand so my strategy is winning i only need one trade to just cover out my losses so if i'm risking about uh 600 if you as you have seen right now plus let's say cp i think plus minus 150 rents risk and then plus nfp i think 150 risk as well rents so i'm if i'm risking 900 rents on these events that i trade monthly 900 and then 900 on on possibly 2500 profit minus 900 then i'm making 1600 so I don't mind losing 90% of my events on uh, four out of three out of four events I'm losing and then only one I make one uh, 2500 and my loss is 900 it's like business your expenses and your income so if you are winning your income must be more than more than your expenses so guys there you have it uh, let's meet on the next uh, sorry about that let's meet on the next event so this was the time where I, I was going to be closing because the event is strong for 15 minutes of the event so it, it's it's done guys it's over now it's done for me i need to go make money and come and trade again because i have other businesses that i focus on that i'm able to fund my accounts because trading you need funding cheers guys stay blessed and send your results comment let me know what you think and uh just criticize me because you are built i'm built by that let's talk guys on the comment section section like subscribe share and then just let's talk cheers guys